Here we have a couple of devices that you uh, probably won't have seen on other tech websites, but what I wanted to have a look at these is basically kids' toys. Now, here is a game that my son has had, an electronic game for uh, quite some time. It's a Leaps to Explorer. It's got a little add-on camera here. We've got the action buttons, A and B. We've got the controls there. It's quite a thick, chunky device, but uh, he's thrown it and chucked it around quite a lot, and it's it's uh, survived to, the de to this day. It's got a on screen sort of touch sensitive screen we've got a little stylus here and we've got rather chunky power pack now the games come in the form of these cartridges here and now there's a new game and it is this the leap pad now very similar you can play a lot of the games are interchangeable so if you bought a game like this here this is uh, the penguins of Madagascar, Madagascar, should I say? My son says Madagascar. You pop this into the leap pad, and you can play the game. Obviously, there's no A and B button on here, so what it does is put the A and B button on the screen. I'll try and show it here. We've got um, SpongeBob SquarePants on this particular one. Some of the games are designed for the leap pad here, the tablet version. The leap pad itself. There you go. You can see. The A and B buttons have been put on the screen, and the original screen size is maintained here on the left-hand side. The leap pad is a lot thinner than its uh, older brother, Leapster Explorer. We've got a mini USB port on the top here. That's for downloading uh, little features and extras that you can get from an on online shop. There's the cartridge. We've got a 3.5 millimeter audio port there. The device is a lot thinner. The batteries go here and here. This is a camera, so we can take photos with that. It's a very rugged device, as you'd hope to expect from uh, from a child's toy. We've got the power on and off here. We've got the volume up and down. We've got the home key and the control key. This is external speaker, but as I say, you can use the 3.5 millimeter audio. There's a stylus that goes there that I've just uh, momentarily misplaced. But there's plenty of educational games here. It's got an American sort of twang to it, but um, you can read books, you can have online books. Uh, sorry, it's not really online. It's not online at all, I should say. But you can read books, you can write, you can draw, you can uh, take photos and scribble all over them. And I must say it's a rather nice tablet for kids. But uh, it will have to compete with Android tablets now coming out uh, designed for children. So this has got a lot of educational games which have been purposefully um, done for this particular platform and they are very educational indeed and uh, I do recommend this particular game.